All right, everyone. So um, this is John Michael for a new episode of Insect Discovery, and right now we're looking at the really small uh, Divarium. Um, and right now we have uh, two insect. Uh, no, there are actually uh, crustacean um, that are actually out of um, in the open. Um, Is this millipede actually eating the isopod? Um, actually, I'm just going to move because that pipe is bothering me, the noise of that pipe. But yeah, actually. Because um, the insect uh, on the left right here is an isopod and this is a millipede. And both really just look pretty much the same, but wow, this is actually pretty grim. Um, I thought they were totally uh, vegetarian, but he's, yeah, we can clearly see some uh, mouth movement, so he is eating the other one. Oh. Um, going to film that way. Um, No, yeah, no, I was, I was better in the other way. Um, <sighs> wait, I'm just trying to find the best way to. to film this. Um, because this is. Pretty crazy. What? The isopod is actually still alive. So what the hell that millipede was doing? I'm going to have to check out uh, the isopod. I mean, does that big, well, big millipede, what, actually eating it, or was he just grooming it? Really not sure, um, but it is pretty damn strange. Um, oh, can I have a good look at them uh, from this view? Yes, just going to zoom on it. So, this is the isopod, this is the millipede, and I think he finished his dinner. So what I'm going to do is try to catch uh, the isopod and see what are the actual damage on it. Yeah. Oops. Alright, so this is the isopod. And as you can see, he actually have some biting marks uh, right here. As you can see, there is like a missing part of his armor. Um, trying to zoom. So yeah, what the hell? Uh, wait, where is? Oh, okay. And as you can see, oh yes, you can definitely see there um, he d he got eaten alive jeez and that is creepy I mean I never actually saw or knew that uh, that could be happening um, yo this is crazy I never saw this, but yeah, as you can see, there is a big biting mark on this uh, isopod. If I can zoom on it. Wait, I'm going to... Yo, look at this. It is crazy. My stupid 
myself I don't want to zoom. Okay, I'm going to zoom on the face. And then boom. Yo, this is crazy. Never actually saw something like that. Um, I don't know what to think about this. Um, I mean, both are supposed to be vegetarian. And that one is still pretty much alive. Oh my god, stupid camera, I don't want to focus. God damn it. Wait, going to... Ah oh man, why doesn't... Oh my god, focus. Sorry, put... Zoom in, okay. Sorry, I speak in French for two seconds. But yeah. What the hell? Um, so, I don't think that Isopod can survive anymore. Uh, as you can see, he's still alive, so it is not a dead body. He was actually still alive. So, the other one predate him. I'm going to do some research about those uh, strange millipedes. I know that centipedes are carnivorous, but millipedes? No. Um, so this little guy is going to be uh, free fish food for the minnows, uh, something that is natural in, in nature. But yeah, never thought an isopod can be hunted down by a millipede. <laughs> Yo, that millipede is completely epic. I mean. I always thought they were complete vegetarian and not even eating live plants, only eating you know, like detritus and such. But he literally bite off a big chunk of this isopod and this isopod was just chilling. This is crazy, I don't... I'm, I'm really surprised right now. Uh, first time I actually see this. Um, I actually thought they were just hanging out together and just cuddling or something because they, they usually do that. Isopod usually do that. Um, if I can just flip this rock and show you. I mean, you can see one of them right there. And I'm sure. Well, you know, they, they just tend to chill like, like that. And most of the time, they just like uh, get on the top of each other's and just chill out. Um, but this one got really unlucky. <laughs> so yeah, um, I'm going to execute him properly um, by putting him in the minnow tank. I'm sorry, little guy. Uh, your death will be pretty quick. Uh, let me just turn you in the other way. Oh, you're drowning. Um, yeah. He got eaten real good. Oh, okay, well, that's a pretty quick death. Um, since the worm of the other videos isn't uh, getting eaten, and I don't want him to suffer, I'm going to... Uh, make him live and put it in this vivarium so he deserves the right to live and when I'm going to feed uh, the worm again I'm going to use a smaller worm and use smaller prey for the minnow I, I understand uh, that but yeah that that millipede just freaking eat this isopod I'm not sure if they're called isopod actually I know that a big marine species is actually called isopod um, but yeah, I didn't ex actually knew what I was going to film on this um, on this video. I was just like, oh well, there is that cool little vivarium I set up. Le let's just check it, check it out a little bit and just flip the rock. And I saw those two uh, animals, and I was like, oh well, I'm going to explain a little bit about this isopod and millipede and the difference between the two. And then boom, I noticed something really grim. Um, so, I guess we discover something today. 
Um, but yeah, I really wasn't expecting that. Um, live a like, I guess, or yeah. I'm sure some of you won't like the the feeding videos, um, but that's okay. Uh, I mean, I'm just uh, filming nature at its best, but sometimes uh, nature can be cruel. So, but yeah, I know that there will be some haters on those videos, but yeah, I'm trying to film as many videos as possible about as many interesting as possible, and something sometimes things don't go the way you want so anyway thanks for watching and i will see you real soon yo that that millipede was crazy